recently I have watched um, a series named is Marco Polo. If you are a person who is interested in history, then I suggest you to watch it because I found it very interesting. That's why I'm sharing it over here. So it's about Marco Polo. He was from Italy and he traveled across Asia during the Silk Road time when the route was very famous for the spices and for all the travelers, travelers because it was a connection between Asia and Europe. Um, so it's a very interesting story. So um, when he went back to Italy, uh, Marco Polo uh, wrote a book in which he described some things about India. So in this video, I have mentioned some of the things uh, that he said about India. So if you are interested in knowing that, watch this video till the end and I hope that you enjoy knowing more about him. An important influence on travelers was a book by an Italian, Marco Polo. Marco Polo came from a family that had grown rich through trade with the East. In 1271, 17 year old Marco set out with his father and uncle from Venice in Italy to travel across Asia to China. They went along caravan routes and by sea to reach the court of the great Khan who was the Mongol ruler of China. On their return journey, the Polos traveled by a sea route which carried them up the west coast of India. Some of the things Marco Polo wrote about India were, the first one was that, in southern India, the peacocks were much more beautiful and larger than in Italy. The second thing was that on India's west coast, more than a hundred pirate ships worked in groups of about 20 lying in wait for a passing ship. The third thing was north of Madras in southeast India, diamonds were found in the mountain streams. The best were kept by the local ruler and the rest were exported to Europe. The next thing that he said about India was that nearly 10% of India's spices were exported. It was 24 years before Marco Polo returned to Venice. He wrote a book which he called The Description of the World. Even though there were no printing presses in those days and books had to be written out by hand, Marco Polo's work was very popular and were translated into many languages. I hope that uh, you must have known something about Marco Polo after watching this video. Um, so thank you for watching it. Stay safe. Have a nice day.